Okay, hello, hello. Uh, Green Eileen here, and I'm doing my review of War Pony by Lori Prindle. This took me about a month to do. I started it on February 16th, and I ended it on March, March uh, 5th, I'd say. And so here is the sticker from Diamond Art Club, but here's the final project product. It is so beautiful. I absolutely love it. I loved doing it. I did it very quickly because I was enjoying it so much. I love the rendition. What surprised me is that it only was 32 colors, but you don't have to go back very far with your eye to see all of the details and the shadows. And uh, like you could see the, main, the colors in the mane and the feathers are gorgeous. There were only two ABs, which I'm fine with because this is more realistic than fantasy. So that, um, that was cool with me. There was a great deal of difference between color blocking and confetti. Great deal of confetti in this section and confetti on the pony's head. The one thing that I didn't understand and I was actually thinking about doing differently is this concho here. This concho, I could see it in the, in the while as I'm filming, I could see where it makes sense, but I really like the colors of that concho up there. I really like those colors. So I was thinking of actually substituting it, making this more like that concho up there. But now that I see it through the camera lens, it makes sense. So now, now I know that when I hang it on the wall, that it will all come together. This is a present for my sister. She has a house in Sedona, Arizona, so this would be perfect for her. This is a 22 by 28 canvas, and I will be making a frame for it and stretching it over the canvas like I did um, two others that I have. I already bought the one by two, uh, one by two wood from Home Depot. The hubby is nice enough to make these frames for me, and. Uh, I really, really enjoyed, really, really enjoyed this project. The one thing that I, that I had an issue with was that a lot of the drills, the majority of the drills are actually very small. So I had this space in between almost every single drill and that meant that I had a lot of room for error and I would have preferred slightly larger drills. So I didn't have these big gaps in between um, in between the drills. So, yeah, because it just, it makes, for me, it's hard for me to, it's hard for me to keep it straight. So I'm constantly straightening, constantly. And I, and I have the really nice, um, the really nice multi-placers from Diamond Art Club too. So these are, here are my, here we go. Here are the nice multi-placers that I've used to do this project and I use uh, clay rather than the wax. It just lasts longer, I'm lazy. Like I don't like replacing the wax all the time and hardly any trash. And here is my stickers that I use to label my, my little jars here, hardly any trash and plenty, plenty left over of all, every single color. So I never ran out of, never ran out of a color. So if I did want to redo that concho, I could, but now I understand what it looks like and I know it's going to look great from a distance. So there was a great, a nice blend of color blocking and confetti. So you could see that like the, especially the sky up here, great deal of color blocking, decent amount of color blocking with the colors of the pony. But then as you get to the feathers and uh, the grasses and this type of collar over here, this decorative thing, this decorative thing on the pony that there was confetti. So this is probably the most confetti I've done so far. This is like my eighth canvas or ninth canvas. And um, I loved it. It just went so fast and so smooth. And I just loved how it came to life as I was doing the pony. It just, just came to life. It was spectacular. So I this is not a canvas that I would do again. There's a few that I would love to do again because I enjoyed every, every uh, moment of it. I think one is one is enough for this particular canvas. Uh, this is, I think, my second or third Lori Prindle that I purchased. So I do like I do like Lori Prindle as an artist. I also have the Shaman. I haven't started that yet, but I will. I'm eventually going to be doing the Shaman, which I think is spectacular. 
So here it is, uh, War Pony, War Pony by Lori Prindle, Diamond Art Club. Highly recommend it. I'm going to review, be reviewing this on their website and giving them a five. Uh, probably this is an advanced intermediate rather than, it's not an expert. I don't think it's an expert. I think that if this is a canvas that you wanted to do as a beginner, you could. Just be sure to straighten as you go so you don't have to straighten at the very end like I tend to do, which takes a lot of time. Loved it. High five. My dogs love it too. Oh, you didn't see them run by, but I've, I have three dogs and they give it the pause up. So thumbs up for me. Thank you.